This Thanksgiving could be the most expensive holiday meal in history because of the increase of a lot of essential items like canned goods and big things like the turkey. But there is some hope in our community and it's all starting with an Olathe Barber. KSHB 41 News reporter Jordan Betts joins us live in Olathe this morning with how donating a turkey could change someone's Thanksgiving and maybe their life moving forward. Jordan, good morning. Good morning, Taylor and Lindsay. Maybe you have a list like this. It has some of those essential items on it. You got your stuffing, your corn, and that middle one is the biggest one, the turkey. That's the hottest thing that you want on your list this season. But it, like you said, it's going to come at a price this season. But say if you have a little bit of extra cash and do you see an extra turkey sitting there, why don't you go ahead and grab that turkey and you can bring it here to Nate's Barber Shop. Because if you bring in that extra turkey here, well, you're going to get a free haircut. But guys, this is not your your normal haircut. Nate creates one of a kind haircuts. I've seen Chiefs logos. I've seen the Disney logo on somebody's side of their head. I mean, you can imagine it. I think Nate can do it. Now he's hoping to get enough turkeys for more than 230 families here in Olathe. He says he thought of a family. He says, you know, the thought of a family going hungry this holiday season just didn't sit right with him. So he wanted to start a movement to feed anyone that needs help. That kind of sets off the tone and, and motivates other people to give and not just to get a haircut, but they're also giving back to the community. The barbershop will be accepting turkeys until Saturday. I can imagine maybe Taylor Hemnes wants to come and get the uh, Chiefs logo on the side of his I head. I know he does. be a nice look, I think. <laughs> I could pull that off. Uh, so, Jordan, this is the third year they're doing that. That's Definitely. amazing. How much has this evolved from the start? Yeah. Since the very start when I covered it three, you know, three years ago or the start of it, they wanted to help six families, guys. What an increase. And right now they have found families. They're the ones that are helping this year through their local elementary schools and hospitals. And they'll be putting baskets together um, this weekend on Sunday. So they're giving more than just a turkey. You know, they're giving the canned goods and things like that. So if you do have some extra canned goods, some that corn and other things lying around, you can also bring it here when you bring in your turkey and get your free haircut. Nice. I mean, Jordan, you're telling us though they expect to help way more than six this year what what are they hoping to do uh, yeah, so they're hoping to help more than 230 families. Amazing. You can imagine, and that also just breaks your heart to see how many yeah. families are really suffering in our area. So even if you don't want a haircut, you can still bring in that turkey and really impact so many lives Absolutely. here in Olathe and just the Kent City Clearly area. Clearly a successful program that needs to do here at Barbershop. Jordan, thank you so much. That's a huge jump in just three years. Talk about finding what you can do. I've got a skill. How can I use it to help yes, somebody? Absolutely. Right there.